Okay, this is Clay Newsom. He's going to be cooking, uh, doing a, a shrimp and crab boil tonight for supper here at Cobb Creek. So, uh, Clay, just explain to us what's going on here. Well, we're cooking for about uh, somewhere between 15 and 20 people, and we have uh, all of our ingredients laid out on the table. We're going to prepare them, and we have a uh, turkey fryer with a uh, super large stock pot. We've got our propane tank to, for our fuel source. Um, Steve Robbins is here. Uh, he's going to. Uh, He'll be boiling the water and getting that prepared, uh, handling the fire, and we've uh, we've got uh, polska, kielbasa sausage. We have yellow onions, red onions. We have uh, corn on the cob. We have uh, new potatoes or red potatoes. Then on this end of the table, we have. Uh, um, just to throw into the pot for anybody that might want them, uh, uh, three large lobster tails. We have uh, some shrimp uh, from Kroger. These are uh, deveined uh, with the shell uh, raw shrimp, and there are about eight pounds here. And then our um, side dish, I suppose you want to say, is uh, uh, cobblestone meal French uh, bread and Steve Robbins will be preparing that kind of separated have... everything out we'll make two runs with the uh, first run will be with this bag of potatoes and I believe there are 12 18 years of corn there and we'll have uh, three packs of uh, Polska kielbasa sausage and we'll have four pounds of shrimp and uh, the key ingredient to all this is so you don't have to add a lot of salt or a lot of pepper or anything like that but uh, Per uh, tank here, and I'm not sure if that's a, uh, what, a five gallon or four gallon tank, um, but we'll use uh, about two caps of uh, the liquid shrimp and crab boil mix. And I usually like to use the uh, Zatarain's brand, but this is uh, New Orleans brand. It was all they had at Kroger. And, um, and that's pretty much our ingredients, but. So, uh, uh, at this point, you're gonna start preparing your vegetables and things, get them ready to go in. You're just gonna, how are you gonna prepare those? Uh, basically, we'll just peel our uh, onions, um, have them ready to go into the uh, pot once the water begins to boil. Um, we will uh, have the uh, sausage cut into uh, uh, different sizes there, different length sizes. Um, have those ready to add into the pot and pretty much the potatoes are ready to go in as they are. So you're cutting up vegetables now, you're just kind of dicing up those onions or? That's right, just cutting them up into random slice size here, I don't know, no particular rhyme or reason. The water will take care of separating them. Okay, Clay, what we got here now? Well, we got some red onions, some yellow onions, if you can see them, they're cut up there in the bottom of the bowl. Like we said earlier, we're gonna do this in two different batches, so I'm just gonna throw some potatoes in there to kinda of divvy out everything into two equal sections here, getting it ready to go in. The Polska kielbasa solid, uh, sausages, we've cut uh, those into different sections, uh, two different lengths, and uh, and pretty much we're ready to go when the water starts boiling on the first batch, and uh, we'll add the uh, add the things in as we go. We'll start with the corn, or the uh, onions and the potatoes, and after uh, 10 minutes or so on the boil, we'll uh, come in with the sausage and the corn, and then uh, after about another uh, 20 minutes or so, we'll uh, Come back in there with uh, with the shrimp and uh, take the shrimp bowl. Bowl again. I just added the shrimp bowl, crab bowl uh, mix, and uh, you can see it's obviously giving a little uh, yellowish red tint to the water. And uh, we're just about ready to add the uh, potatoes and onions. Smelling good. In fact, just as it comes to a bowl, we'll, we'll put them in there.
So you have the potatoes and onions in there, is that correct? Yeah, for round number one, I got the potatoes and the uh, onions in there, and we'll let them boil for uh, about 10 minutes or so, and then we'll come back in with the uh, corn and the uh, uh, sausage. That's the bowl that we've been looking for right there. Never never get the potatoes, the sausage, and the corn, they're all in there. Round number one is almost ready. How long will you let the scrimp cook? About three to five minutes. Maybe not even a full did, five. More like three. Did you check a potato to see how well it was done yet? I actually did. I cut one there, but let's show you right just here. Watch out, Max Max. Hot, hot. Very, very well ready to eat. Oh, yeah. yeah. Just right. Good deal. So how long will it be before you add the shrimp? Uh, about to add them right now. We're uh, trying to stall for a little time so we can get the bread ready and get the papers laid out. And, uh... Okay, going in with the shrimp. Two lobster tails are already in there. Let's put another... Uh... Pounds of uh, shrimp into the uh, mix here. Okay, I bring that back to the boil now. Is that correct? That's right. I'm gonna stir them just a little. See the shrimp have already started turning pink mm -hmm. from their white or gray colors. And uh, shortly after that comes back to a boil, we'll we'll be pretty close to uh, to dipping it out, ready to eat. Okay. There's the uh, lobster tail if you want to see one of them. Nice and juicy looking. Mm -hmm. Very good. Let her boil for a little bit. Looking right. Looking good. Come on over here, Pamela, and take a Got some uh, corn there, potatoes, got some shrimp, got a uh, lobster tail in there. And, uh, potatoes and onions, and you can see how she's cooking up there. Awesome. At the time we get her to a bowl, we're going to be ready to go. Good old bread man. That's right. Travis Robbins here, Steve's son, my nephew. Favorite nephew. I'm sorry, favorite nephew. Tell us what Jimmy is. Your name Rubber Baby? See, she's starting to come back to a bowl, and, uh, and the shrimp are obviously coming to the top as they they're done and the lobster tails and uh, the uh, potatoes and corn are dropping out to the bottom. That's right. And uh, so we're, we're pretty close to serve time here. Maybe it's another minute or so. It's going to be relentless. Y'all come on. Come on. Where you got there, Pamela? Uh, wow, it looks lovely. There's shrimps, spuds, corn, or taters as you call them. Very good. Okay. It's all right. Enjoy it. Thank you.